What's going on, everybody? It's Zion here, and the game uh, you're seeing today is not my gameplay, but a, a friend of mine. Uh, his name's NipTip. Uh, he doesn't have a YouTube account, but he's a really cool guy. He let me use this gameplay for my channel. Just to show you this, uh, this is the new game mode, Money in the Dank. It's, uh, it's a good MOAF you got uh, using the Desert Eagle, which is quite cool. It's, I mean, this game mode, I heard about it, like, about a few months ago, actually. Someone made a video about talking to people like, tweet this in Infinity War, this game idea, but the game idea sounded pretty good, the concept, but I gotta say, this is the what the worst game mode I've ever played of any mar any Call of Duty game. I mean, it can be fun at times, but the, here's the real problem. Um, it just turns into a spam war where people like throwing your nades and stuns and stuff. And whoever gets the bomb, Juggernaut basically controls the game, because, I mean, the Juggernaut's gonna be surrounded by his teammates, so if you, you try to attack the Juggernaut, you'll be picked off immediately. While he sits back and gets his killstreak rewards or specialist points, which I've been playing the past uh, day or two, I haven't. I don't. I think my game's glitched or something because I don't get uh, my my perks anymore for the Juggernaut. I was like 18-0. I, I only had like one perk, and that was Scavenger. I don't know if that's a recent patch or not, but I can't get specialist with my Juggernaut anymore. Uh, tell me in the comments. Maybe you know why. And uh, while well, I'm thinking of it, um, now nah, I'm gonna save for another commentary, but. I mean, this game mode's pretty good. I don't like how it's. I mean, the classes are set up okay. It's just like all scav. It's all like flashes. That's my real problem with this game mode. And you're gonna see he goes on a terror if this does eagle once he gets a specialist point reward. I mean, I've been trying for one of these, and I was really close, but I just couldn't get it. Oh yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about it anyway. Okay, no more favela in Marfer in Marfer 2. I don't know if you guys heard about this. Favela is now gone erased off the, the game. I don't know how long it'll be gone, but it was taken out due to some uh, issues. Apparently in the bathroom above B, the B flag in the building, there was a, a picture frame, and in the frame it said something about Allah, you know, like the Muslim god who they believe in. Apparently he... Oh, look at that knife. This guy got done up. <laughs> okay, apparently it had something about you can't have... Apparently in the religion they can't have stuff like that in the bathrooms. And so, due to like, I guess they're gonna fix the problem, and hopefully bring out the map. But right now, there is no favela, which that was one of my favorite maps from Mario 2, just because I don't know, the way it played out, because the levels of buildings and and stuff you can like flank around. It was a fun map. Yeah, I can't believe it's gone. I mean, it's ridiculous. Yeah, let's see what I was talking about. I mean, and Christians, I mean, you know there's like a huge cross in the background, and Christians don't get upset with that, and there's actually a picture in the map with Jesus on it, except he doesn't have a face, and Christians didn't complain. Apparently some guy was just camping so much, he ended up finding that. <laughs> Which I thought was pretty funny, he ended up finding that and complaining about it. Well, look at those double kills. Yeah, this is a great game. And for some reason, while the Juggernaut gets like speed, he runs like super, super fast for Juggernaut. So if they get specialists, they're extremely hard to take down because they can just run to cover with their teammates. The way you play with the Juggernaut is to get your streaks. You just isolate yourself from the other team, let them come to you. As long as you're having those one-on-one -on -one engagements, you'll always win. And you need to be able to retreat to like regenerate your health. And that's the main way to stay off the Juggernaut. You can get some some good streaks going. Oh, oh uh, I don't know if you know this, but you actually get all the proficiencies for your secondary if you have specialist bonus. And you actually you get kick for your Desert Eagle, which it barely helps, but helps a little bit. As you can see, it's just like, yeah, it's Blast Shield Pro there. Uh, and Blast Shield, I hope they fix that. I've talked about this before, but they really need to have like a better system going for like Blast Shield and whatever they're going to call it, Flat Jacket. Because apparently, Flash Bangs and will just affect you for so long, and they're just spammed in this game. You know Blast Shield Pro, um, the explosives, they... It doesn't stack up, just like, because like in, uh, I remember, well, Black Ops, you could be throwing like three, four grenades at you and still live. And, like, Tactical Mask Pro, you could just, uh, take stuns and flashes for days, they don't do a crap to you. I just want to smell a little ramp, and he, here he gets the Moab, which is pretty good. Uh, maybe you want to send him a message over Xbox, nip tip, just say thank you for the awesome game. Hope you guys enjoyed, don't forget to maybe rate the video. Give it a like rating, maybe subscribe for more. I got some more things going. Alright, I'll catch you guys later.